awaiting uh, the assemblance of uh, the crew uh, into the Poisk module of the International Space Station as Wakata, uh, Tiran, and, M and Mastrakio prepare uh, for the, um, the newly arrived crew members, Kvartsov, uh, Swanson, and Artemayev, uh, to uh, begin the process of uh, reopening the hatch. Uh, the hatch was opened at 9.35 p.m. Central Time. Uh, the crew uh, returned to the Soyuz uh, for some cleanup activity inside, and now uh, we are standing by for uh, the reopening uh, of the uh, Soyuz hatch and the subsequent welcoming ceremony with all six crew members together. We are not clear. You know, we are aware of uh, a uh, quick... LOS in the KU band coverage, but you know, it's still not coming, so maybe we should get started. Well, you know what, Sergey? We're in space to ground one, right? For a voice com? Can you confirm? Yeah, and uh, your report should be in space to ground one. Got it. Well, you do the talking, Moscow. All right, guys, you are go to press. Oh, we are seeing you on the big screen down in the main control room. Okay, are we go to open the hatch? Uh, we're opening the hatch. Absolutely. You are go to press. And this is Mission Control Houston, the uh, hatch to the Soyuz vehicle about to be reopened, and the six crew members uh, will be together to initiate our welcoming ceremony. First in, uh, the Soyuz commander, Alexander Skvortsov, returning uh, to the International Space Station four years after he was a crew member of Expedition 23 and 24. Oleg Artemyev, uh, is board engineer, now on board uh, the International Space Station for the first time. And there is NASA's Steve Swanson, greeted by Koichi Wakata, Rick Mastracchio, and uh, Mikhail Turin. All six crew members now together on board uh, the International Space Station, and they will be moving from the Poisk module into the Zvezda service module uh, for the welcoming ceremony that is just moments from now. And uh, now you see uh, the officials and family members gathered uh, on the balcony overlooking the International Space Station Flight Control Room here at the Russian Mission Control Center. As soon as uh, the six crew members are uh, settled in in the Zvezda service module with their headsets on, we'll be ready to begin uh, the event. And uh, we should be picking up that video. There we go. The newly arrived crew members in the blue flight suits having uh, removed their Sokol launch and entry suits two days after launching from the Baikonur Cosmodrome in Kazakhstan. We're able to see you, so I pass the floor to our balcony guests. We are 
ready for the conference. ISS, this is uh, Moscow Mission Control. How do you copy? This is Bill Gerstenmaier. Uh, Bill, uh, this is Station. Uh, we have you loud and clear. How do you hear us? I hear you great, uh, Kuichi. Um, it's awesome seeing all you guys on board. We were hoping you'd get there a little bit earlier, but we're glad you're there. And uh, really enjoy your time on board the space station to the new crew and to the crew that was on board the station. Uh, welcome your new friends. Yeah, thank you for your nice words. Uh, and uh, we are so happy to have uh, Sasha, Oleg, and Steve here. Okay, well, now I'll turn it over to, to some of your family and uh, friends that are here in the control center. Hi, Steve. Oh, no, it's Mary. Great. Thank you. Hi, Steve. Hey, how are you? Good. How are you? Glad to be there. <laughs> Doing fine. Yes, I am. That was a long trip. There was a little traffic on the way. The latest again a little bit. <laughs> kind of like in Moscow. <laughs> I'll let Quinn exactly. talk to you. I'll let Quinn talk to you. Okay. Hey, Dad. Hey, Quinn. How you doing? I'm fine. Uh, you have fun. Two days in a small capsule, floating around. <laughs> yeah, luckily, it was the two good guys, but... Uh, Oh, I think it's cutting off. Yeah, I think it did too. Uh, I think you can hear me now, though. Uh, yeah, we had we had a fun time. <laughs> it was a little bit long. It was a long two days, but we made it. Glad to be here. Well, that's good. I'm Thank glad you uh, I'll let you talk time? to your parents. What was that? Okay. <laughs> Are you up past your bedtime? Your mom's letting you do that? Welcome on board. Hi, Dad. I can see you smiling at me. We're also waving at you. I hope you're doing well. So, how do you feel? Are you feeling good? <laughs> yes, they said just right. <laughs> Traffic was significant during those two days. <laughs> We're very happy for you <laughs> that you're finally there, that you finally are all together, and it's now much room in there. <laughs> yes, there's much more room here. <laughs> but it was still okay. <laughs> we did it. <laughs> Great. And as I understand, you had to wake up early today again. Nothing to do. Okay. We still have time to catch up on our sleep. The main thing is for you to get good rest. We'll try to. Hello, our dear crew. Very happy to see you on board your new space home. We are glad <laughs> to see that uh, you have good-looking faces, that you are smiling, that you are calm. And uh, we will be looking forward to talking in private to you, so that we can not only look at you, but also say something ourselves. Thank you. Thank you, Lena. Thanks. Sasha. Uh, Sasha, we need to have a new relationship. We need to have a new relationship with the space station. The first time, the station didn't want to see you leave, and the leave was postponed by one day. At this time, the station didn't want to let you in. Two more days. Anyway, good luck to you. We are looking forward to seeing you here on the Earth. All the best, best regards, good luck. Thank you. 
Okay. Hi, Steve. Can you hear me? This is Mom. Yes, I can. Okay. Mom, how are you doing? Okay. <laughs> and we just wanted to tell you we're happy you're there now, finally, and have a good time. I'm sure you will. It'll be quite an experience. Yeah, well, it'll be fun. Have a good time. Thanks. Thanks for coming. Thank you. Okay, and tell you goodbye and give it to Dad now. Okay. Okay. Hi, Steve. This is Dad. I'm. Uh, How are you? Happy that you're there, even though you took the scenic route to arrive. Uh, yeah, uh, actually, yeah, sure. Yeah. We're we're anticipating you having a very successful six months and. I'm glad to see that you're with a lot of friends that you've known before, and I'm sure you'll accomplish many things. Looking forward to see you back on the ground. Thanks, and uh, I can't wait to see you guys again, too. All right. Love you. Bye. Bye. Love you, Love you too. Bye. Bye-bye. Hello. Hello. Dear Ucho says, Can you hear us? Yes. All the best in your home. And I've got a short poem. Let this space to be far away from you, but still the same. Your goal has been achieved. We are with you, and we hope to see you on the earth. Sounds good. Thanks. We are really worrying about you, but now you are in good hands. All together. Hello, dear Misha, Rick, Koichi, Oleg, Alexander and Steve. This is uh, your colleague Anton Shkaplerov talking. I'd like to congratulate you on the successful docking. Say hi to you on behalf of uh, the entire Cosmonaut Corps. We're all worried and we'd like to say thank you. And we're happy that uh, your families and uh, your friends and your instructors got together and your colleagues. We'll talk to you again this evening and uh, we'll say one word to you. A separate uh, word of uh, congratulations to Oleg Artemyev on his first flight, his first days in space. Have uh, a good job on board the ISS. We're looking forward to seeing you on the ground. You can still stay there a bit longer than you probably intend to. That's okay, but still good luck and all the best. Thank you, thank you, too, too. Oleg, get big hi from your family. Good luck. Good luck with all the experiments. Hopefully everything will go smoothly. Good luck again. Thank you, Sasha. Hi, Stevie. It's Sandy. Yes, I understood. I said so. You look great, and we can't wait to watch you as your adventure unfolds here. Congratulations. Thank you. I'll see you soon. Well, maybe in six months. Hi, Stevie, it's Laura. Just want to echo everybody else's congratulations. And good luck on the rest of your adventure. Thank you very much. Take care. Uh, ISS, this is the uh, Mission Control Moscow again. I think this concludes our event. Uh, the ground teams are here ready to support your expedition. We're looking forward to making your stay happy. I can tell you all your family will be here supporting you every day that you're in space. So have a great time. Your friends on the ground are looking up with you at Envy. We'll watch your space station fly overhead. We'll wave at you many times when we see you. So have a great expedition. Mission Control out. Thank you, Bill. Uh, we will have a wonderful time together here. Thank you. Спасибо за брифинг. Закончилась связь.
Thank you for the briefing. Our time is out. And with that, uh, the brief welcoming ceremony comes to a close. Uh, Bill Gerstenmeyer, NASA's Associate Administrator for Human Spaceflight Operations, uh, opening and closing uh, the welcoming ceremony that uh, featured congratulatory calls uh, from families, uh, well-wishers, other VIPs here in the Russian Mission Control Center. So with that, uh, the newly arrived uh, Soyuz crew uh, can uh, press ahead uh, with uh, its uh, orientation and familiarization work as uh, they begin uh, the work to transfer some cargo from the Soyuz TMA-12M spacecraft into the International Space Station and have an opportunity uh, to uh, settle in and uh, discuss uh, future plans as the six crew members now uh, will share time with one another over the course uh, of the next two months until uh, Commander Koichi Wakata, Rick Mastracchio, and Mikhail Turin uh, undock their Soyuz spacecraft and head back for a landing uh, uh, in Kazakhstan to wrap up their six-month mission. The newly arrived crew, NASA's Steve Swanson, uh, Soyuz Commander Alexander Skvortsov, and uh, Flight Engineer Oleg Artemiev uh, will uh, familiarize themselves with station systems. Wakata, in the next uh, few hours, will be conducting a safety briefing uh, to orient uh, the crew with escape uh, routes and uh, all other uh, safety procedures on board the International Space Station that is customary. We've just installed clamps, and as soon as we're done, we're going to let you know. And as soon as I'm done with the clamps and stove, I'll let you know. Copy. Standing by. For uh, Skvortsov, uh, Artemiev, and Swanson, uh, a welcome opportunity to stretch their legs after uh, the confinement of uh, the Soyuz spacecraft over the past two days and uh, their 48-hour rendezvous uh, that took them uh, to the International Space Station from the launch pad of the Baikonur Cosmodrome in Kazakhstan. This uh, newly comprised crew will be extremely busy over the next few weeks, uh, greeting uh, visiting cargo craft uh, from Russia and the United States, as well as the European Space Agency. Uh, there will be uh, spacewalks scheduled both on the Russian side and the uh, American side out of the Quest airlock throughout the course of the summer as uh, the crew presses ahead with a variety of research and operational activity.